A VIP rolls up to McLaughlin Middle School, accompanied by a police escort. Orly Waba came to Mac to give a speech about kindness and was met by dozens of students dancing. This is the, probably the greatest surprise that I ever got from anyone by far. November 12th is the sixth annual Dance for Kindness, a worldwide event founded by Waba and the Life Fest Inside organization. In more than 50 countries, thousands of people will take part in a flash mob, dancing to the same song, and a freeze mob where participants hold a pose demonstrating kindness. Waba, a former teacher, began Life Fest Inside with a video that's been seen more than 30 million times online. It's about kindness, believing in yourself, and treating others with respect. And that's why I became a teacher, because yeah. I love kids, and it's about inspiring them to, to pursue their dreams and to pursue their goals and to never allow them to have the words of others or the cynicism of others pull that dream away from them. Teacher Jason Hattrick invited Waba to share her story with a packed gymnasium. Waba talked about concepts that hit home with middle schoolers, like staying true to yourself. We're teenagers, like just starting out, like people just start acting differently towards their friends and their teachers. They just, they just need something to remind them that they're them and they don't need to change for anybody else. Waba hopes to inspire kids to treat others with respect. With everything going on in the world right now, the messaging is just so on point. These students hope to make these basic principles a part of everyday life at Mac. Kindness is everywhere and that you have the power to change uh, things based on what, how you act and that your actions have a lot of meaning. When you see someone like not just judging them or being rude, just being kind to people. Mm -hmm. You are showing them that they are an equivalent to you. The final takeaway? Follow your dreams. Nothing is impossible if you believe enough and, and you have the courage enough to pursue it. Inside Vancouver Public Schools, I'm Amanda Richter.